Greetings. This is Stephen V. Richardson, and welcome to your business growth tip of the day. Question for you. Have you received your fortune yet? Do you have your fortune? If the answer is no, not yet, I have a recommendation for you. Check your follow-up. I want you to imagine all of the people who you have interacted with with regards to the business that you're growing, the product or service that you're selling. All those people who you've had a conversation with, who you've interacted with, who you've reached out to, who maybe you've even done a presentation to. Think about all those people and then think about what percentage of those people have you properly followed up with. If you're like most people, if you're like me, especially back in the day, that answer might be embarrassing. And it's really money on the table that we are leaving because for whatever reason, we did all of the work. First and foremost, we have our created, partnered with a company and have created a great, amazing product or service. We develop our skills and in order to understand what that is and how to communicate with others. We've identified who we want to have those conversations with, who we're looking to help. We somehow, some way have had an initial contact exposure with that person. Maybe we bumped into them in the normal course of our lives. And then we set the stage for that next conversation. As I discussed during a previous conversation, I talked about properly exposing Maybe it was just reaching out, telling somebody hello, seeing how they're doing, getting back on their radar. And then if that person responds or not, but especially if they respond, sometimes we drop the ball and don't follow up at all, let alone properly. So the biggest takeaway of this part is follow up 100% of the time. And if for whatever reason you're thinking about the people who you would have, could have, should have followed up with and you didn't, it's never, ever too late. So first and foremost, let's follow up with everybody moving forward. But also, what is proper follow-up? Now, proper follow-up simply means continuing the conversation, but doing it in a way that you are truly building a positive, strong, mutually beneficial relationship of credibility and trust. Really understanding what somebody else wants to do, understanding what their goals are, and then asking permission if you can share with them how you might be able to help them. Now, taking into, let's just say, context of our previous conversation, where an initial contact was just saying hello, seeing how somebody's doing, if and when they, they respond to you, that's the when you follow up and you follow. Proper follow up is doing it. Proper follow up is doing it in a short period of time. And the other part is just really not jumping the gun and starting to talk about your product or service, but most importantly, build the relationship. Because when you ask somebody else questions about their life, about their family, about their business, if they're the right person and if they're at the right place in their life, they're going to ask you about what you're doing, about what your dreams and goals are, about what your company and how, how things are going. And when they do that, that's your opportunity to check if they're open to getting some information. So for example, if you're looking to expose your business, you've reached out to somebody, they responded, you followed up. And during that conversation of reestablishing the relationship and they ask you about your business, maybe you say something like, hey, as a matter of fact, I'm building my business right now and I'm looking for some more people to help. Let me ask you a question. Would you be open to allowing me just to share with you what I'm doing? Not necessarily for you, because I'm sure you're already doing extremely well, but would you be open to having a conversation where I could at least share with you what I'm doing, where I'm going, let you know the type of people I'm looking for? So if you happen to know that person, or if you happen to come across that person, you'd be at least willing to introduce them to me so that that person and I could have a conversation. Would you be willing to do that? Because once again, getting back to exposures, everything, all we really want, if we're doing this properly, we want people to know who we are, know what we've done, know what we're getting ready to do, 
and know that if and when the time is right, they can think about us. So that's part of the proper exposure, to, uh, proper follow-up. So that's really what I wanted to share with you today. Proper exposure is everything. The fortune is in the proper follow-up. And next time we'll talk about working with the willing. That has been your business growth tip of the day. See you next time.